Get out of here, spawn of Satan. Blackberry Ridgians. We are back up here today. Today is Sunday. I was up here yesterday, but I didn't film. Uh, just moving some stuff around with the tractor, piddling a little bit, uh, getting some stuff inside set up for today because it is getting ready to rain, I think. It feels amazing out here. Um, it is got a north wind today and uh, got some cloud cover. See if you can see that. Let me try to zoom in on that because uh, that's pretty cool looking back over the hills there. The storm rolling past, but we are, Duke and I are back up here. Uh, we've got the intern on the way. I don't know that I've officially introduced the intern or not, but he is, uh, he's a kid that um, his dad does some work for us in my other business. He's a subcontractor of ours and I uh, just kind of posted it one day about needing some help up here, some manual labor, and uh, he's been up here helping us clean up. I don't know if you've seen him in the background of some of the last few videos. He's been helping me pick up around here just because of it was just so much to do and cleaning up is not uh, something that is I consider myself to be very productive, but it has to be done. Necessary evil. So he's helped us out with that. Uh, since all that, he has informed me he's going to a tech school here where we're at and uh, he's uh, I think trying to get educated in some trades which is awesome I th would highly encourage anybody to do that that was on the fence about college or any of those things at least it would be a great fallback take a year go learn some trades uh, you can always come back to that there will always be a need for electricians plumbers heat and air guys I think that is a very smart thing to do. So I got completely derailed there because that's not what we're doing today. What we are doing today, the intern is on his way up here. We are gonna do some stuff inside. We're gonna sheathe uh, the shop wall so that we can secure that up. Uh, then we are going to the intern. I'm just gonna, I, I haven't really asked him if he wants to be on camera yet, I will. I'm sure he won't have a problem with it. So like to protect his stuff, I'm just calling him the intern. So the end, I'm not doing it out of disrespect, nothing like that. I'm just, yeah. So he's on his way up here. He's going to stain some cedar for us because the Jays are coming tomorrow to do some exterior framing and I'll get some video of that as well. So I'm going to do all that. And then also it's a perfect day. It rained a little bit last night. It rained yesterday. I'm going to try to burn some trash, so some construction materials. We're going to get that done. So full day today, lots of fun, I guess, fun. <laughs> if you like this stuff, it's fun. And yeah, so let's get to it. Duke's up here with us. Hey, Duke. Hey, hey, hey. Say hi to the people. Some people have uh, expressed concern for Duke's lack of discipline. I'm going to show you how disciplined this dog is. This is my dog, and he's disciplined. Duke, sit. <laughs> sit. There you go. Duke, heel. Heel. Sit. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. None of that had anything to do with the fact that he's wearing a shock collar, I promise. So, uh, let's, uh, I'm going to get some diesel out. I'm going to pour, I'm going to get at least one of the fires going, probably one on each side. Maybe all three of them just to get them going and get it over with. This is a great day to do it. So, we're going to get that done. The intern may be pulling in and just get after it in general. So, come around with us. Come around with us. Come along with us. Come along with me. Thank <laughs> you. 
Duke, did you grab my camera again? Ugh. Come here. No. 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 Stupid dog. Okay, well, I have no idea what the last thing you saw was because, uh, well, Duke. We got duked. We got duked. But, uh, yeah, I've got both burn piles going over here on the south side. And uh, now I'm going to go over here to the north side to get that one going. Uh, everything's a little bit damp, so it's not burning great. So we'll just see how this goes. But uh, everything else around it is damp, which is what I care about, really. So I don't want to burn down Blackberry Ridge. Okay, well that's uh, fire number one and two are going. And uh, now let's go do number three. Okay, so we have owned this property for uh, about a year and a half now, and I have yet to see a snake out here uh, in the wild. And this place is known for snakes, particularly known for copperheads and rattlesnakes. And I figured during this whole time, doing all this construction and stuff, we would see um, we would see snakes under piles of wood, things like that. I, we have not until now. The intern won't even get close. I don't do snakes. <laughs> he doesn't do snakes. I don't do snakes either. I freaking hate them. Uh, and I just flipped over a pallet to uh, get into the fire to burn. And let me see if I can flip this around. Probably not without stopping the recording. Okay, so. Okay, so here we are burning this pile. I don't know if you've spotted it yet or not, but uh, I don't know if it's dead or not. We're gonna poke it and find out but I am pretty sure I just found the first snake on Blackberry Ridge and it just so happens to be a pygmy rattlesnake based off the coloring. I have not seen its head yet, but it has not moved. So I'm not even sure if it's alive, but uh, we're going to find out, which is just great because I've walked over and by this pallet about nine times today. So I really hope that it's dead. And, um, and also I really hope my wife doesn't watch this because if she sees this, she's going to freak out because she hates snakes as you guys have seen in the past. So let's give it, there it is. Let's give it a little poke. Nope. It's alive. So that's great. I'm gonna just go. Uh, the intern's going to go back inside. He's officially done. He, I think he's quit for the day. Um, let's see here. Yeah. It's a pygmy rattler for sure. I'm trying to find its head. Its head is up there. Let me see if I can zoom. Man, that fire's hot and he must just be loving it. But there he is. Um, you can see his little tail sticking up. He's got a little rattler on the end of it. But I'm gonna have Tate um, film from a distance. Tate. Tate's the intern's name, so I guess you all know now. So Tate the intern is going to uh, film me exterminating this rattle of snake. All right. Keep it sideways. You got it sideways? Yeah. Okay, I need to get a, uh, a clava. A clava? Something heavier to hit it with than what this is. There's some boards with nails in them in the <laughs> other pile. I mean, if you're feeling lucky, try and stab it one time. Here we go. Here we go. Ah. 
This is the poker. This is the enforcer. Keep the phone sideways. All right. Can you see it good? Or are you zoomed in? Uh, kind of. Yeah, you can see it. Why don't you come over here? Because I'm going to fling it that way. Okay. So I can get it out in the open and inspect it. That's probably... Oh, that's hot. That's probably a stupid move. I should probably kill it first and then inspect it, huh? Yeah, I'd say that's a good move. Should I kill it first? I'd say that's probably there the best goes. move. Okay, it's done. Whoa, that's hot. If it's not done, it is not happy. <clears throat> it's still trying to move. But I've basically chopped him in half. Okay. Yep. Here, bring that. Here, hand me that. Hold the enforcer. Okay, so yeah, this is a pygmy rattlesnake. Diamond head, but the dead giveaway, I'll get real close here. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Is that his tail he's got a little tiny rattle on it he's still moving but that's mostly just instinct but i'm not going to uh give it the benefit of the doubt i'm not going to get close i'm just going to pick him up and throw him away but that is a pygmy rattlesnake and supposedly where we live they're pretty prominent where the farm is so we're just going to be careful right yeah we're going to flip over fast and check everything before we just go to shoving our hands down stuff. That sounded really aggressive. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Agree. So we're going to go back. What we were doing was just tending these fires, throwing all the other miscellaneous stuff that didn't make it in there in there. And that little guy was hanging out, I guess, trying to get a meal or he was attracted to the warmth of the fire. Whatever it may be. That's awesome. We're excited about it. So now we're going to go into, we might just burn the barn down at this point. All right. Tate, the intern, wants to just exterminate the situation. So he's got the like enforcer out. Oh, Whoa. did you get him or no? I hit him dead on. Okay. I so hit him right on the head. This is what every snake deserves. Get out of here, spawn of Satan.